Now we're getting a little lesson in weather this morning with the help of the Imagination Station in Toledo. This is Chief Scientist Carl Nelson. Not, Mel not Mike Nelson. <laughs> Don't know what I'm thinking. Either way, you're going to have your chance for revenge with the blowtorch and whatnot. Look, this morning you're going to give us a little taste of what's going to be going down at Weather Day in Comerica Park here exactly. in, what, a few weeks now? Exactly. It's Wednesday, April 22nd? The 25th. 25th, all right. Uh, Thursday. I don't know. Check, out, check out the Tigers' it. website. I'm sure they have all the info there. But I thought we would do something that we do at the Science Center all the time down in Toledo. We like to blow things up. Right on. Light things on fire and talk about things like combustion. But we're going to make sure we're safe first. So all go right. ahead and put on some safety glasses Fair here. Enough. I brought with me today some balloons filled with hydrogen gas. Okay. All right. Now for combustion, you need three things. You need fuel, flame, and oxygen. We've got oxygen in the air because we're breathing it. We've got fuel inside those balloons that are filled with hydrogen gas, and our flame is going to be this little stick here. Go ahead and grab that. Now I I'm appreciate gonna... the length of this. <laughs> I'll tell you that That's right. a safety measure as well. So we're just going to light this up. All right. All right. You've got your candles. Now, now what I want you, you to combustion, do. I mean, blow up. Blow up. All right. What I want you to do is just kind of snuggle that right underneath one of those balloons, and let's just see what happens when you combine fuel, flame, and oxygen. Closer. Yeah. Just, just push it right in there. Right Get it right, right in there. Right in there. Bring it up. Up. Okay. Jeez. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Okay. All right. All now right. That's, that's combustion. All right. May I blow that out? You blow that, that blow? up. Blow that up. That's fine. We're, we're all done with the little candle. Holy <coughs> Now we're going to amp things up a bit. Oh, now we're going <laughs> to Now we're going to raise things up. Okay. We'll take the stakes a little bit higher here. All right. So what we had there was oxygen in the air and hydrogen inside the balloons. Can you imagine what would happen if you combine the oxygen with the hydrogen all in the same balloon? Something <laughs> even bigger. It's, it's going to be guess. it's going to be a detonation as opposed to just a little explosion oh, like that. Oh, and this is there. the part when I get to get involved. You get to even be involved more, huh? even more. Got some soapy water there. I want you to dip your hands down in there. Get your hands not only wet, get your arms wet past your wrists. I should say any hair you want to keep on your arms, go ahead and get it wet. You know what? It's almost beach season. We'll right. go ahead and so uh, help me mix up my uh, soap solution I don't there really a little shave bit. My arms. I just wanted it. That <laughs> was supposed to be a joke. Okay, so that was a bad one. So, okay. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> All right, that's good. Now, go ahead and bring that soap all the way up to about right here. Okay. What we're going to do is I have a balloon over here filled with a mixture of hydrogen and oxygen gas in the ratio. I'm sorry, Jay and Taryn, where are you guys going? <laughs> you guys came for the show. You get in here. Oh, there. You get in there. <laughs> they're, they're, they're appropriately scared. They should be. Oh, okay. So hydrogen and oxygen gas in the ratio of H2O. It's the perfect ratio to create a supersonic detonation. Oh, my so God. So what we're going to do is I'm going to make like some bubbles hair. in this soapy water. Your job, Alan, is you're going to scoop up as many as the bubbles as you can, but leave the water behind. Okay? So we're going to theory here that bigger is better. Okay. So the more bubbles you grab. Now, better for better. my health or better for the viewing? Better for the viewing better audience. For, oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Come on. We want to have, have some fun with this here. Okay. Am I good? So, oh, I forgot to tell you, too. It's going to be incredibly loud. Oh, because the last one wasn't. <laughs> Wait, you blocked my right oh, ear. Oh. All right. There we go. It's going to be really, really loud. And... I want you to actually step away from, from that tray of bubbles. Come oh. over here a little bit. And now, uh, now you said no water. Now I feel I feel like my hands are a little wet. They're a little wet. I oh, want you to okay, open, open your hands up. Oh, Get them flat. Good. Three, two, one. <laughs> Check that out. All the bubbles that were in there are now gone God. as well. As right? well as the hair on my so arms. Just kidding. That's it's what still you there. call a supersonic right? detonation. Are you all right? All right, we got to go. Listen. Get the full screen. <laughs> Weather day. Are you okay? Oh, gonna... oh now you can. Don't act like you care. Don't act like you, to you leave. care. All right, look at those. Look at, look at that. The one and only Ben Bailey. You can talk to him. Weather day, Comerica Park. There's still, still time to sign up. It's Thursday, April 26th. All right, we gotta go, but we've got more from the Imagination Station. Maybe we'll get these two chumps involved next time. All right, we'll be back after the break. You needed this. Shot Alan, dude.